Okay, today is day 39, 39 days in a row of walking at least one mile. So I'll put the camera on and we'll get started. All right, start the timer here. Put in your guesses how long I'm going to go at least 1.15 miles, how long I'll walk, and how long it'll take. Walking in a part of the neighborhood today I've never walked before or even driven. I don't think I've ever even driven on this street, so I see a lot of different things today. We'll see what's going on. Beautiful blue sky today. No rain. Oh, that's a big house there. It's about five or six bedrooms. Write down in the comments how many days in a row this is for you. How far you've walked so far. Oh, that's unusual. If you're new to the channel, Bright Magic Marker Green BMW. Look at that. Super bright. What your goal is, they say people with written goals are 10 times more likely to achieve their goal than people just think about their goals. So write it down and come back every day and update your progress. I'll be checking it every day. I upload a new video every single day. So it's 39 days in a row. So go for 60 so I'll be uploading a new video every day nice blue sky today beautiful warm about 60 nice and sunny now over under of dogs today I'm gonna go low I just don't think there's gonna be a lot two and a half Now look at this house, it takes up the whole corner here. Spanish tile roof. Interesting. And uh, Manhattan Beach, just borderline to Redondo Beach today. The house will probably be a little bit maybe a little bit bigger. There's an aqua colored door. even driven on this street before, let alone walked on it. See what we see today. See if we see any vintage cars. I see at least one. We always seem to see at least, we always see at least one antique car. That's a big house there. thing here almost on all these streets it's like almost every house looks different from the house beside it uh oh here comes a car Got a three car garage there house with a flower on it. You know, look. I don't know what color that is. Dark maroon. Close to the school down here. The school takes up a whole 
couple of blocks to high school. This is a high school, yeah. Near a Costa High School. Oh, is this a house? Well, that's unusual window for a house. You usually see that in office buildings. Pretty warm today. No, no more rain the rest of this week. Uh, said it might rain next Monday. Let's hope not. adding on to this school or something. I don't know what they're doing. Uh-oh, looks like somebody's lost a pet here. Let's see what it says. I don't know, a male cat. Ollie. Super friendly. Oh my gosh, he's been missing for almost two years. Wow, they're still looking for it. It's chipped. Yeah. If you see the dog, call the number. It's kind of a unique door. Looks like they have swans. I guess those are swans. building over there, I guess. There's another house with a three-car garage. That's the front door. Aqua. Kind of hidden. Definitely a different walk than yesterday. Yesterday was more along the street. This is definitely more neighborhood-ish. Houses are right on top of each other. They'd be big, but there's no property. It's a succulent front yard. I think I've ever been on this street either. We have a couple cars covered. I don't know what they are. Cod type of house? I don't know what kind of design you would call that type of architecture. It's on a corner, it's big. Yeah, let's just walk on down this street, come back up. See what's going on down here. Thirty-nine days in a row. There's a Bronco with a red R. Boy, look at the tires on that. Look, a lot of people are buying a Ford Broncos. This garage is orange. That orange tile around the garage.
Well, it looks like somebody's moving here. Got a Penske truck rental. Uh, must be moving out. Mama Leone left a note on the door. A lot of nice windows there. What kind of architecture? Spanish? I see old houses in the 60s and then all of a sudden you see like a brand new huge house. So they still got a Christmas wreath up. Oh, they missed all the holidays. Still celebrating. Kind of an olive colored house. Look how far back it goes. It takes, houses on the corner seem to be long. Take a look at it from the side. Sunny today. Almost need the sunglasses. Oh boy. I have to start wearing them soon. Another big two story house here. Always the ones on the corner. Wow. The one right across the way from it. It's even bigger. Man, three car garage. Like some kind of security fence over here. Walk over here and see what it is. It must have a pool or something. That's one thing you don't see much. No one has a pool because uh, there's no yard. Matter of fact, I can't recall seeing any house in the Manhattan, Redondo, Hermosa that has a pool. Highly unusual. I don't think they have a pool either. But nobody has pools. Really weird. Wow, look at this house. How many windows is that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14 in the front. 15, 16, 17, 18. Two more on the side. Three car garage. 18 windows. A lot of windows. Here's a unique ranch. One story. A lot of different houses. All right, that's 0.65. Time to make the turn back. It's this guy. We got like an upper second story balcony. So far, no dogs, no cats. 
No squirrels, no cranes. Yellow door. People like yellow and aqua and red doors, it seems. There's a tree with a bunch of oranges on it. Look at that. Tons of orange. That time of the year, the orange trees and lemon trees are bearing fruit. No vintage cars yet either. I guess they see at least one. Maybe we'll still see one. We got halfway to go. Well, it's nice. No rain today. As you want to see me battle the rain, watch a, a couple videos ago. I had to walk in the rain twice. The second day I walked out of my shoe, the shoe completely sole came off. I had to go put on another pair of shoes. The umbrella was blowing inside out. Boy, it was something. Don't get a ton of rain here, but two days in a row I had to walk in the rain. The umbrella was blowing inside out. I did see a big crane, a stork or something. Comes a van. No stop signs on these streets. No signal either. Another three-car garage. A lot of these houses have three-car garages. What is this car? Lucid. Never heard of a Lucid car. I don't know. I guess that's the brand. It looks like a Tesla. Maybe it's a type of Tesla. I don't know. Let me know if you know. Lucid. Heard of a Lucid Dream. Another car house with a yellow door. Yellow doors are popular. Look at that, they got a cactus growing up on the side of their house. Their door sideways. Garage in the front and the door on the side, sort of angled in there. And another yellow door. years old or more. I don't know what it was. A Chevy or a Ford, I guess. It's like school's out. No, no kids are in the parking lot. No. Yeah. Head back down the street.
Yeah, let me know if you've had to walk in the rain or the snow or cold weather what you've done if you've started on this to try to keep the streak alive if you're trying to do a mile a day or half a mile a day or it's 39 days in a row for at least a mile a day for me and try to get to 60. first 30 days wasn't too bad like I said, a couple, a couple days I had to walk in the rain, but overall it's been pretty, pretty nice. I'm down to the beach one day. I'm gonna go down to the beach again soon. One day I walked and saw the Ferraris and Lamborghinis, and I'm gonna walk over there again soon at that garage. Yesterday I gave somebody directions. One day I almost got backed over by a car. Uh, check out some of the past videos if you want to see any of that. That was something. I don't know what he was doing. He's backing up on a one-way street. Then other cars started coming. They were all backed up. So people started blowing their horn. Yeah. Different types of houses on this walk. So far, no vintage cars. Kind of surprising. There might be, could be one there covered up. None are just sitting out. Somebody running. I don't see a lot of runners. Probably seen maybe five and four or five in 39 days. Don't see that many people running. I think you would with this nice weather. There goes another one way up the top of that hill. Pretty quiet street. We seen more construction and workers than we have people. Yeah, almost at 1.15. That'll be it for today. Back the street that we came in on. Here's this uh Magic marker color. Is it a forgot what it was? BMW, yeah. Bright. M4 competition. If you drive a car that color, say uh, bright colors cars are more likely to get a ticket. I always say red cars are more likely to get a ticket, but now we're seeing tons of these bright green, bright yellow, magic marker type color cars. People really like those. The uniforms of college teams are all those bright colors. I think Oregon kind of started that with magic marker looking. Now a lot of colleges do that. Yeah, I'll talk a little bit more here. See if we see anything. 
a different different view today than normal like I said I never never walked in this part of the neighborhood before I don't think I've even driven on these streets and, uh, different types of houses Lock another little bit down here. Nice and warm today. Hello. Hi. Yeah. I'm not going to walk down this big hill back again. That's about it. And get back to the corner. Mailman, I wonder how many, how far they walk a day. They got to walk. Whew. I guess anywhere from five to ten miles a day every day carrying a backpack a big truck super duty the Ford so obviously a later model truck I don't, I don't know not too much trimmer too much about trucks Here at Costa Football, it's on the high school football team. There's nice garage doors there, look at that. Nice finished. And we're back to the big, long, white, 16 window house. All right, that's it. Kind of back to where we started. If you like the video, subscribe, thumbs up. Check out some of the other videos I was telling you about. Always something interesting. Come back tomorrow. Bye.